You know, I had a really, really instructive experience recently where my director of human resources came to me and gave me feedback that at work I was being a little cold. And that the one time that I told her what really happened on my weekend, a really personal experience, that I let my true self show, that that was the moment she felt like she wanted to follow me as a leader, that she felt that she liked me and wanted to uh, work for me. And so I saw how important emotional intelligence is relating to people is in the leadership setting. I was going through a change in my career, change in my family life, um, change in many personal areas where I felt like I needed some help. And this group of people who I've become very close to helped me in really every aspect of morphing my life into the way I wanted it to go. Whatever is discussed in that room, in that group, there won't be judgment, there won't be advice thrown at you, that it will be shared experiences, and that it's completely confidential. So in that setting, with that, with that setting, you feel that you can really at last open up and talk about the real issues. When there's conflict, rather than focusing on the topic itself, I focus on the person and the emotions that they're trying to communicate. And I listen to that. And I stop and I ask, is that it? Is there more exploratory questions? And it really just calms the situation down that I'm listening. And then we can go forward with the, with the process and address it in a much more calm manner. The chairman of the board of our company, I met with him. I explained that I was doing this emotional intelligence program. And I even explained what I, what I needed to do to have a clear communication with him. And we opened a session. And he was so intrigued by this that rather than the 30 minute meeting that we had scheduled, we had an hour and a half meeting. And in that meeting, he gave me incredible coaching about what I was to do as the next steps in my career and at the company. It was invaluable uh, bonding experience with him. I decided since my family's in transition, there are a lot of things changing my family, that we needed to introduce a reassurance that there's going to be love in our house every day during this transition. And so I picked my spouse and my kids to every day give them a hug and look them in the eyes and say, I love you. Almost immediately, I got that same response back. And you know, it's now become an expectation of this, this feeling of no matter what happens, I love you. There's no question in my mind that this emotional intelligence process works. It's changed my life. It's helped me as a leader in the workplace and at home. I think it should be basic coursework in every college, not only just for leaders, but for people who have to manage day-to-day -day life. It's very powerful.